Hey beauties, it's me, Casey, again, and um, tonight I just wanted to come to you guys with a new video. Um, if you follow me on Instagram, then you see that I posted a picture of this new product. Well, I don't know how new it is, but this product that's out on the market right now um, that should save you a lot of money. So, um... With that being said, oh, let me just mention to you guys, so I'm going to start be, um, doing reviews for you, but I don't know, I just don't want to put review on it. So, um, I don't know if you heard me say this before, but me and my cousin have the same woman, I get it together, forget it forever. And so, I want that to kind of go with my um, reviews, so it's just going to be got it together or forget it forever. So, I'll be just letting you guys know if a product's got it together or if you should just forget it forever. So let me show you guys the packaging. So this is the original makeup eraser. And basically what it is, it's a cloth that you're just supposed to wet with water. It has no chemicals in it and you literally just wipe off your makeup. So I'm not too sure how well this is going to work. I do have on a waterproof mascara, um, some eyeliner. I pretty much have a full face right now and that's another reason why I want to do it right this second even though it's like 1 o'clock in the morning. But um, I don't really wear a full face of makeup often so I was just like let me do this tonight. So, um, on the side of the box it says, remove your makeup with just water, waterproof mascara removed in seconds, all natural, no chemicals, machine washable, no stains remain, soft and promotes healthy skin. So with that being said, basically you're supposed to just be able to throw this in the washing machine and then all the stains are gone from like your mascara and stuff. Now my only question is, do you have to throw this in the washing machine every time you use it i have never heard anybody say you know anything about it do you just keep using it until it's ready to wash because if you're like me and you live in new york you do not have a washer and dryer in your house you have to go to a laundromat or maybe it's in your building or whatever the case might be and wash you know your clothes pay those quarters girl and wash those clothes and so i mean if this is something i have to wash every time i wear makeup that would really suck only because it's like so I'm supposed to just go to the laundromat every night and wash this. Like, that would be too much. So I'm definitely going to have to look into that and find out. So, yeah, let's just open this box up. Now, one thing I do love about it is that it's pink. And that is my favorite color. So that's really exciting to me that it comes in pink. And has this little thank you card, which is nice. Um, yeah, they're all about having... Um, distributors i've noticed like on the actual package that you know gets delivered to you from like your post office and stuff it says become a distributor day and then the back of this card basically tells you your starter kit to start distributing this product so i guess the, you know they're working hard to get you know their name out there and custom business cards this is all that and then on this side it says thank you for your purchase erase makeup with original makeup eraser save money and chemical free um, blah, 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 okay, number one, wash, wash eraser prior to first erase, hmm, washing instructions on tag, so apparently I'm supposed to wash this before using it, number two, wet portion of makeup eraser, drenched water, use warm water, so I'm guessing with that wet portion, they're saying that, um, yeah, just wet little portions and use that side for that day until you're ready to wipe it off. And it's not that big, so I would say like maybe like three or four times and then you'll be done. Uh, I'm not too sure how I feel about that. Um, erase, gently rub off makeup in circular motion, then flip eraser to long nap side to exfoliate. So it has an exfoliating side. And four, wash, wash makeup eraser as needed. Washing instructions on the tag, dry, dryer and dry sheet friendly. Okay, so let's open this up. Now, oh my god, this side feels so soft, guys. I wish you guys could touch it. It feel, feels so, so soft. And um, it has these like really long, I don't know, hairs, I guess you can say. And then the other side is really short. It's not rough or anything, but I guess this is the side that you're supposed to exfoliate with. And this is the side you're supposed to, like, wash your makeup off with. And then it has a tag. Let's read this tag that they're talking about. So it's 100% polyester. Uh, machine wash, cool, delicate, no chlorine, bleach, 
um, tumble dry on low. And then it just has the little logo and it's made in China, if you care about that at all. So yeah, I'm I'm not so sure about the wash erasure prior to first erase, but like, I can't do that. And I'm just trying to get this video out for you. And I'm really curious to see if this works because my only makeup removers burn my eyes right now. Like the one I have, I had to just buy something quick because my the brand that i love it's always sold out i like the neutrogena but the um hydrating one it's like um aquamarine teal i guess you could say kind of package um the regular ones the just like original neutrogena makeup removal wipes they kind of dry out on me i don't know if you have that problem but like when i'm wiping my face like i feel like it dries so fast i need to really feel like there's makeup removal on my face so i like the hydrating ones because they're really moisturized and like you know, it just feels good. It just feels good on my skin, especially because I get really bad dry spots on the side of my face. I do have combination skin. I get really oily in the T-zone area, but like here, it's just like more dry than oily, if that makes sense. So, um, yeah, I'm going to go drench this and I'll be back. Okay? All right. Okay, I'm back. So, I got my makeup eraser all soaked and wet and ready to go. Um, I am sitting on the floor. Like, don't judge me. This is just kind of comfortable. And it's a little bit more easier than setting up my tripod and stuff. I'm just too tired to do that. I don't know if you can hear it in my voice, but I really want to get this video done. Because um, I, like, really don't want to use those makeup removal wipes I have. So, um, I don't have, like, a mirror nearby. But I do have this bad boy so you know i'm just gonna use this so let's get started shall we i'm gonna look a little cray cray for y'all but it's all good it's all good so this is the soft side so i'm going to start i don't know why i'm nervous i'm gonna start oh yeah hmm. Hmm. i don't know why i'm so excited about taking okay so so far it's taking my foundation off. Like, oh my god. That looks gross. Ew. Okay. Lipstick. Mmm. Okay, that took off my lipstick without any problems. This feels so good on the skin, guys. Like, it does. I'm not even joking. My curls are in the way. <laughs> I was going to put my satin bonnet on. And I was like, oh no, girl. You're taking a little too far. It's going to look really crazy. Now I'm thinking I should take my satin bonnet off. I don't know. Alright, I'm like skipping the eyes right now. I need to... That's where it matters. Okay, I think this took off my foundation and stuff like perfectly seriously this is crazy okay time for eye makeup in the eyebrows say bye bye to my eyebrows so you guys are getting 100% me right now oh this is sick do you see that I should have did half of my face I'm sorry oh my god my like <laughs> my miss my um what is that called my eyeshadow's like gone i'm too excited i can't even talk wow oh my god okay so as you can see my mascara and eyeliner is coming off you know it may take a little little extra swipes but like Dang, this is crazy. Okay, moving on to the next eye. I don't know why I feel like this is getting a little dry, like I didn't wet it enough. This is really sick. This is sickening how crazy this is. Like, so I was watching, you know, a lot of videos on this, and I'm like, on their, like, Instagram, and I'm like, hmm, they, I feel like they lying to me right now. There's no way that a claw, I'm going to have to go, dang, did I wet one side more than the other? Okay, we're just going to move it down some so i was like there's no way that a like a wet cloth is gonna remove all of your makeup like i find like that to be impossible but let me shut up because hunty this is coming off okay so it does leave you know a little extra like eyeliner you know little raccoon eyes but that's pretty common i would say 
But, like, you can see, like, it is really removing my makeup, guys. Like, it really is. And it feels good on the skin. Get the neck. Get the neck. Remove my curls. I feel like I should wet this a little bit more, though. Wow. A little bit of stick. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Okay, and to flip on to the exfoliating side. I don't know how it's supposed to exfoliate my skin, but, you know, whatever. about the eyes so okay I think that's about it yeah I think that's pretty much it I mean my cleanser would take off any additional makeup that's on but I would say that this is a got it together like this product has definitely got it together um it really removes all of my makeup like I mean I do have a little bit just a little of that eyeliner running. Just a little bit though, but nothing crazy. And I feel like almost all products really do that. I mean, it's you know, take a, just like a, a little Q-tip and, you know, clean up whatever you have to clean up. And, I mean, if you are about to go to sleep, if you have a nighttime routine, you're just going to wash your face a little bit anyway. But this really did the job. This really did remove a lot more than 98% of my makeup so kudos to that now um, I'm guessing for the next time I wear makeup I just use a little of the other side um, yeah a little of the other side and keep doing that until I run out of space I'm assuming which that's the only downfall in my opinion I wish it was like put it in your sink and drench it and all the makeup be going and use again but of course that's just like asking for too much but I'm really impressed with this product guys I would say if you want to save a couple of dollars and get a makeup removal wipes then this definitely could be something um it's cute it's just easy to like you know roll up put away you don't have to worry about it trying out so yeah I'm definitely definitely digging this product so this is definitely a guys together i hope you guys enjoyed this video um please like comment and subscribe that would be amazing and watch all of my other videos and, and tell me what you think and things like that so um yeah i will leave all the information on where to get this product down below um and anyway for you guys to keep in contact on a more personal level like instagram twitter tumblr pinterest snapchat and every other social network in the world um you guys have a lovely week because this will be up by monday and i'll see you guys in the next video okay love you bye